Hey, Cloud Dwellers, is my face too close to the camera? What about now? Today, Cloud Dwellers, I'm going to get educational on your ass. I'm going to talk to you about the Goldilocks Zone. It's that perfect place between two opposites. You see, it comes into play during basically every part of our daily lives. You can be too angry. You stole my cereal! Or too happy. That was weird. Our planet, which is called Earth, sits in the Goldilocks Zone of the solar system. The Goldilocks Zone is an area in which a planet is just the right distance from a star. It's what it looks for when searching for planets outside of our celestial neighbourhood that may harbour life. So according to this neat little app I have, there are 860 exoplanets, which are planets outside of our solar system. Space stuff is cool! Astronomers have found many so-called super-Earths, which are basically Earths with capes. <laughs> Just kidding. They can be anywhere from one to ten times the mass of our planet, which is called Earth. They have super catchy names, such as High Definition 69830B and Ogle 2005BLG390LB. Could probably use some work. Because our planet, which is called Earth, sits in just the right spot, so it's not too close to the sun, so it's not too hot, and it's not too far away from the sun, so it's not too cold, it means we are able to have such wonderful things, such as KFC, and uh, Buckets, and Heather Graham. She's not in the Goldilocks zone. Holy hot crust buns, she's hot. Whoa. Mm. Uh, sorry. So they're saying something. Oh yeah, Heather Graham is a smoking hottie. Oh, there's no point in waiting around. I'm not going to be able to go on.